Now that you've signed up for a tenancy website and logged into your site for the first time, the first step to getting started is to select your theme. The theme determines the overall layout and the colors of your website, and it's important to select your theme before you start adding content and images because each theme has different sized images, different shapes of their logos, and you wanna make sure that you have selected what it's going to look like, and then start filling in the content in those spaces. There's two ways you can go to change your theme. The first is from your dashboard, you go over to your right hand side where you see the different update theme settings and the top one is change themes. You can also reach this if you're on another page than your dashboard from your admin bar at the top where you see themes. It tells you what your current theme is. Here's where you would adjust theme settings once you've selected your theme and at the bottom you'll come down and click to change my theme. Both this part and on your dashboard, the Change My Theme, goes to the exact same place where you'll be able to look at the different themes and you can select the one you like the best. So here we are. Here's the theme. It's a simple drop down. Again, the current one is PR Firm. And you can select a different one, update the settings. And here you see that now the sites changed the size of the logo is square instead of rectangular the bullet points theme has a different shape logo box which and then here's the home page of what bullet points looks like if we come back to change my theme we can also look at other ones to see which one we like best keep in mind some of the colors are adjustable later on in other settings and we'll go over that in another video for theme settings. However, I'm just going to show you quickly how you can see this logo is a different width from the one that we saw originally and it's got different content spaces, a different layout. You want to find the one that fits right for you. I'm going to go back to PR Firm. That's the theme that I'd like to use to set this up. And as you can see, changing themes is very easy. When new themes become available, you can upload them through this setting and find them in the drop down. Once you have selected your theme and you're ready to start adding content, we highly recommend you stick with it. Later on, there'll be advanced editing on your themes so that you can change some of the content, even if a new theme comes out that you really like, so that your existing one won't lose the look and feel and layout of your site, and you can still add some of those features. Once you've started adding content and your site's going live, changing your theme will remove some of that content if it's not available in the other themes, and you could really change the usability of your site. So make sure you're really happy with the layout before you start doing anything else. So that's how you change your themes in Tendency.